is the first human clone still alive? Imagine a world where cloning humans is a reality. It's a topic that has sparked intense debate and curiosity. But have we actually achieved human cloning? Let's dive into the story of the first claimed human clone. In 2002, a French chemist named Brigitte Boisselier, who is part of the Raelian movement, announced the birth of a human clone named Eve. This claim was made by CloneAid, a company founded by Claude Vorillon, the leader of the Raelians. According to Boisselier, Eve was born by cesarean section and was a clone of a 31-year-old American woman. However, there's a significant catch here. Despite the dramatic announcement, there was no independent scientific verification to support this claim. Boisselier refused to provide any evidence, such as DNA tests or medical records, to prove that Eve was indeed a clone. This lack of evidence led many in the scientific community to believe that the claim was a hoax. Additionally, CloneAid claimed to have four other mothers expecting to give birth to clones, but none of these claims were ever verified. The absence of any concrete proof makes it impossible to confirm whether Eve or any other claimed human clones actually exist or are still alive. So to answer the question, there is no reliable evidence to suggest that the first human clone, or any human clone for that matter, has been born or is still alive. The claims remain unverified and are widely regarded as unfounded.